Okay, so let's have this problem. So uh, write the first five terms of the sequence given the n term. So that's a sub n equals negative 1 to the power n times n squared. So to solve for the first five terms, so let's start with a sub 1. So for a sub 1, n is equal to 1. Then substitute this value to this formula. So we have negative 1 times uh, n is 1 to the power 1 times 1 squared. Then negative 1 to the power 1 is negative 1 and 1 squared that's positive 1. So negative 1 times 1 that's negative 1. So this is for the a sub 1 or the first term. For the second term that's a sub 2. So your n now is equal to 2. Then substitute. So negative 1 to the power 2 times 2 squared. Then negative 1 squared is positive 1. And 2 squared, that's 4. And 1 times 4, it's positive 4. So this is for the second term. For the third term, that's a sub 3. So your n is equal to 3. So negative 1 to the power 3 times 3 squared. And negative 1 to the power 3, that's negative 1. And 3 squared is 9. And 9 times negative 1, that's negative 9. So this is the third term. And the fourth term is a sub 4. So your n now is equal to 4. So negative 1 to the power 4. Then we have 4 squared. Now take note that uh, if the exponent of negative number add number, then the answer is negative. But if the exponent is an uh, even number, then the answer is positive. Then we have 4 squared. That's 16, and 1 times 16, this one is positive 16, this one is the fourth term. And the fifth term is sub uh, 5, so your n now is equal to 5. So at negative 1 to the power 5 times 5 to the power 2. So negative 1 to the power 5, 5 is odd number, so therefore this one is negative 1. And 5 squared, that's 25. So negative 1 times uh, 25, the answer is negative 25. So these are now the first five terms of the sequence. So negative 1, 4, negative 9, 16, and negative 25.